All right, what's good, baby? We're up at sunrise. We're gonna get some really cool footage going through the gorge. I hope you guys are excited. I'm excited. It's gonna be gorgeous. No pun intended, baby. Thank you. See you soon. Oh yeah, it feels great out this morning too. I could have worn my jacket this morning. No, it's gonna be another hundred today. But once we get to Colorado, I'm for sure gonna need my jacket. So, and I think I might have some homies coming with me to go up Pikes Peak because I'm definitely doing Pikes Peak. There's no way I can go to Colorado not ride this bitch on Pikes Peak. Ooh, it is crisp. Oh. I got more power now too because it's, uh, it's a little cool. The cold air, that cold air, yeah, 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 yeah. Right. Oh my god, I'm excited. We're only like 10 minutes from the gorge. We woke up at 5 a.m. this morning literally to get a sunrise in the gorge. Hopefully, get some gorgeous pictures. <laughs> nah, but yeah, oh, uh, it's gonna be so insanely gorgeous. Yeah, okay, I'm done. I'm done making puns. The, today's ride is going to be much, it's probably, it's going to be the most interesting ride of all of most this trip, actually. Uh, the Rocky Mountains is awesome. Oh, it's perfect now. Damn, bro. I mean, you really can't get much more gorgeous than this. Oh, I gotta stop saying that. Man, this place is beautiful. Anyway, I'll be, I'm really uber excited for Pikes Peak. That's, uh, that's coming up, baby. I'm trying to conquer a lot of mountains on this trip. I want to hit Mount Rainier. I want to hit Beartooth Mountain. I want to hit Twisted Sisters. All right, I'm going to rip through this shit. Never mind.
we stopped at the Arizona sign. We're going to stop at the Utah sign. You know how girls are. They like pictures and shit. I'm going to post this anyway. Bike so fast, it's great. Such a healthy bike for the soul. All right, this looks like a nice straight stretch for Maxi. Yes, sir. stops at 189 I, I believe I, I gotta match it up with the GPS and the GoPro and see what uh, how well it correlates I do want to pop some wheelies I really do and this is pretty ideal spots I could try a couple I'm thinking the third gear clutch ups, like I'm not trying to 12 o'clock these by any means. Let's get it up for a little bit. Take 
takes a lot of confidence to get this thing up. I want to say the altitude's ruining it, but I don't think it is. I think it's just me being a f Where are your clutch plates? I can keep it pretty low. It feels pretty comfy. But you guys saw me shift it there. It's not like... Unless you're... Uh, unless you're full booze. But even then it cuts power for a split second and this is a heavy bike up front. If this thing was naked, it might be a different story, but it's actually not that heavy up front. I mean the, the heaviest thing is like the the head stay, the headlight. That's really it. I mean speedo is not heavy. There's um uh, ECU's up there, it's not very heavy. You got over here, you got a lot of wiring. Not much weight, but yeah, I could do the second gears. But again, I just gotta keep practicing. And I need open roads, not any traffic. I don't need to pull over, so. My wheelie practice is very minimal <laughs> at, at the moment. I-70 baby, this is one of the fastest on-ramps I think in the United States. 75 mile per hour on-ramp. So I'm talking about baby. Should be able to do a little top speed here. cross and I duck it low enough, the thing's just gonna skip off the top of my head. I should plow right through anything, unless it's like a bison. Bisons are thick. Those rocks are cool. That's dope.
I, I have absolutely smoked the living shit out of Jane. Like she is probably three miles behind me. How fast are you? How fast do you cover ground when you're going like 200? It means every 60 minutes you're going 200 miles. So if you break that down into, let's say. 30 minutes, 100 miles, 15 minutes, 50 miles, 7.5 minutes, 25 miles. Yeah, I covered a little too much ground, that's for sure. Dudes, I'm heading into the storm. First storm of the trip. I don't know whether to go slow or fast. I feel like it's better to go fast. We'll see. I can smell the rain. Oh boy. Oh boy, it's wet. And I don't have trash control on. I didn't prepare for this. I did not prepare for this. Nope, 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 nope. I'm pulling over. I'm not down. GG's boys, GG's. That sucks. I definitely have to wait. It's f***ing pouring, so. Yeah. Oh my god! Someone left me a full pack of Bud Light! God damn, it's my lucky day, boys! Woo! And we back, baby. Hopefully. Catch me back there. I'll wave to him and I Yeah, yeah, that's me. I know. Alright, I'm pulling over. Yeah, I figured as much. Yeah, that happened. Speed day, you're going a little bit faster there. 101 miles an hour by my LiDAR. Do you have your driver's license with you? I do. It's gonna take me a second. Okay, I got you. Where are you coming from today? I'm coming from, uh, I'm doing a cross country road trip with my wife. Oh, yeah? She's in a car and oh, okay. I just started, I just got out of the rain. Hey, that's her. 
Oh. Where'd you start driving from? Today we started in Mesquite, Nevada. Okay, just stay over there. Do you? She has the insurance. Oh, okay. Right. And the registration, it's gonna, it's gonna take me about 15 minutes to get it out of the fairing. Okay. Is, do you have like an actual license plate on there? Yeah, there's a license plate. I just rebuilt the bike, so it's a custom bracket, and I don't know, you know, it's not very. I mean, you can read it from here, yeah. What? Oh, there it is. Yeah. I had to build it so it didn't scrape, you know, if it hit the wheel. I didn't want it to hit the wheel or anything, and I'm not very... Well, that's, uh, I mean, it's technically not... Proper? Proper by Utah's law. Yeah. You're supposed to be able to see it from 100 feet back. 100 feet? Yeah. Man, my vision's not even that good to begin <laughs> Oh, shit, I almost ran to your car. That, that, that's the basis for all of our licenses. Uh, I understand. You want me to? You want me to get my toolkit? I'll be okay for today's purposes. I mean, I don't know what South Dakota's uh, laws are like, or I'm assuming it's. <laughs> Do you want me to go get my uh, uh, toolkit out of the car? No, uh, you'll be okay. I'll uh, just go and hang out here for me. Okay. If you have a pick, I can get out the registration. Exactly. See, I put I put the registration in this fairing here. Be fine. See it here. So if you have like a pick. If you like a toothpick or something, I can just pull it out maybe? I don't know. Is it a California registration? Yeah, we just got it registered and everything. It's right. it's yeah, that's street legal. Just hang on here for a minute, I'll be right back. Thank you. Can I get a cliff bar? Sure. The, the guy. We're good in those ways, okay? Uh, just make sure that you have some sort of proof of insurance in case you don't have your wife with insurance information. Does it say I have insurance on here? It does say you have insurance with California. Uh, it doesn't say it on the... Oh, you weren't able to... All right. It doesn't. It doesn't get to all California says is yes or no. Right? So, uh, I got to 101. A little bit too fast for, for the regular road. Okay, I mean, I know these things can do that that sort of speed uh, pretty easily um, but I just need you to make sure that you're uh, keeping those speeds okay I understand uh, for this I'm gonna give you a ticket today I'm gonna get uh, you, you can have, have to contact us if you're canning justice court between 5 and 14 days from now so not less than 5 no more than 14 the phone number and citation number I've highlighted here for you I uh, just give me a phone call I'll tell you to take care of it okay you don't necessarily need to come all the way back on um, the first time you contact him just give him a phone call all right hmm. there's that for you if you have any other questions real quick Mm -mm. Okay. Uh, make sure you're filled up on your bike and batteried up before you head over this canyon right here. It's 106 miles an hour. 106 miles. 106 miles an hour? No, 106 miles in front of your next uh, um, uh, stop. 106? Yep. Hopefully you can get that kind of mileage, <laughs> mileage out of these things. But any other questions? No. Okay. Have a safe rest here. Just make sure you're keeping the speeds down, okay? Mm -hmm. All right. We've had three fatal accidents this year. Uh, in this, in just this area alone. Were they wearing helmets? Involving my motorcycles. Okay, two of them were wearing helmets, one of them wasn't. Were they all wearing airbag vests? What? Were they wearing airbag vests? Uh, it would not have helped. Why? I mean, a, a, couple, a couple of them. Head on collisions? They just went straight off in, into like some rocks. Like. That'll kill you. Yeah. yeah. So, anyways, just wanna make sure that you're you know, being safe out here. Yeah. Okay? I'm always, okay, your trip. I'm always safe. Can I? Can I see the calibration on the LiDAR? What's that? Can I see the calibration on the LiDAR? You can do that in court. I mean, if you want to, you can look at this. It, is there like a calibration as far as date? Actual calibration check. I did one this morning at my office. Okay? Right. And then the, 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 the records of calibration are, are maintained in, in our file. Okay, but I mean, we, 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 cal I don't necessarily have to prove to you that on the side of the road right here. Yeah, no worries. I just thought I'd ask. Calibration is, is proper when it is. And then you ping me at what mile marker? So this is mile marker 56. And this is right where you pin me? Like what? You pin me right here? I think down by the sign right there, but that, that, that So that, that's the spot right here at this sign? Uh, yeah. let's see. Oh, that red car is right now, or orange or whatever. So coming around this corner back there about, what is that, a mile? Uh, mile, and a half. mile and a half? Half a mile, 
mile to a mile. Half a mile to a mile. All right, thank you. Appreciate it. Obviously, I'm gonna call a lawyer. Ain't no way I was going that fast. Do you go first or me? You could have really f***ed me. With the license plate, no, no mirror, you name it. And you gotta ask some questions. They usually are the one badgering you. When you badger them, we'll see, we'll see what they can do about it. Let's see how many points. I'd be willing to go with a no points ticket. You know, first offense. Really cool area right here. I, I, this is a gorgeous gorge. <laughs> they could put fa they could carry faces into those. That'd be dope. Really cool spot. Dude! I wonder why those things like stick out like that. And that's probably filled with gold. There's probably gold all over. All up in them there hills. Oh my gosh. Was this a quarry or something? Is this a job speed road? Should I go for it? Should I go to prison just to pop out the bike? Nah, I'm good. Dude, you need more than an Africa twin to get through that shit. You would need like a burrow or a horse or something ridiculous. Anyway, this is basically how I'm getting to the next stop. Rain mode, 85, cruise control, no hands. Cause I gotta, I gotta slap on the wrist today. Wah, 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 Maxie's day is done. I'll call the lawyer, I'll see how many points it is. If it's worth fighting, I'm telling the story. I'm not gonna show the footage of the pullover until like get it sorted out, obviously. But uh probably gonna get more tickets on this trip. I'm about to go into another horrible storm. So should be interesting. God, that looks horrific. <laughs> yeah, this, this might be the end of the GoPro, this video. <laughs> Let's try to stay down here, but... That looks pretty bad, so... Oh my. Holy shit! I can't do this! that cop too but dude I, I couldn't I had to speed up to get out of that like I could have easily the bike could have died and I could have froze dude <laughs> dude 
Yeah, definitely don't continue, guys. You're f***ed if you do. Yeah, f***ed if you don't. Turn around now. I am f***ing... <coughs> soaking, bro. That was bad. That was bad. That was intense. Good thing it was short, though, dude. That would have been any longer. Oh, I'm very glad. I'm not getting pulled over again. <laughs> I would have been pissed. I literally would have. I, I probably would have been pretty pissed. <laughs> awesome road here. up about four or five times a day. Probably about once every hour and a half. Alright. Just got done with our last stop before Grand Junction. So, pretty excited to get to Colorado have a little drying out to do from that rainstorm. Dude, I, I'm like reflecting on everything and today's been a pretty rough day. I mean, I could have been much worse, don't get me wrong. Like, I don't know. That's a lot of water to ride through. Could have hydroplane. Could have gotten a no mirror ticket. Um, a mismounted plate ticket. A um, could have got in trouble for having uh, a vape pen on me, a Mary Jane ticket. I could have got triple, triple bent over, really. And if you bend over three times, you're basically back where you started. So, but we still moving forward. Let me just say that. Oh, who's driving? Matt, the Tesla. I'll tell you what's, who's not driving. The Tesla. <laughs> oh my god. You gotta love it, dude. The weather right now, though, is phenomenal. Phenomenal. Obviously, I gotta do another top spin. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> but uh, I'm chilling the rest of this ride, thankfully. Pretty excited for the Grand Junction beat up tomorrow. I think there's going to be quite a few people. At least two. I know that. And, uh, and then I'm going to do a Denver meet up a little later in the day. So tomorrow's going to be popping. It's already been interesting. We had Nikki Cage. We had Nutty Night Ride. We had the Popo. Rode through a monsoon. We had Gorgeous Gorge. We've had top speed runs, wheelies, you name it. It's been going down. And uh, it's just gonna continue to... It's gonna continue to unfold. Those are the Rocky Mountains up there. I know that for factual data. Okay, so I was like hella wrong. Those aren't the Rockies back there. That entire range is the Rockies up there. I think. Okay. I really want to do a top speed run. So I'm gonna fucking do it. And this is like a perfect stretch. There's jack shit on this road. And it's very, very straight.
still not enough room. I don't feel comfortable going around cars at 189. Sorry guys. It's not really my goal to dive, so I like to keep my distance when I'm going 200 miles an hour. I mean the stability, this, this machine was... Justin and I did very good putting this back together, let me just say that. It runs like a million bucks. God, I would love to try that again. That was like all too smooth. It's honestly like perfect, this road. Oh shit, I'm sorry, I'm a dumbass. I'm a... I just woke Billy up, probably. <laughs> yeah, I'm basically like 90% sure that range is Rockies. Hope you guys are excited for them. Do we have a top speed run here? There's a, another one. Oh. Not quite long enough. Well, she remember. She missed it. I didn't. What a noob! This one's deaf. She's deaf. Uh. Uh, dude, she has nowhere to turn around. <laughs> She's f***ed. <laughs> Literally. She doesn't pay attention at all. I can't wait to get there, baby. I don't think I'm doing anything else. Well, I haven't gotten a speeding ticket in Colorado yet, I guess. I could check that off the bucket list. Yes. I just can't go over 30 over. I need to research the laws in every state if you can go to jail for speeding or not. You know? I bet if they consider it dangerous or like a public safety concern, then it's but if you're just like on an open road, kind of like I was, it doesn't really care. I don't know. I need to think about it. <laughs> Yay! We made it! Grand Junction! Oops. Did Jane just miss the exit? Ooh. Oh no, she can't! It wasn't even recording! Ah! The Grand Junction. I totally just talked to myself for a long time, which is bullshit, but whatever. I do that a lot anyway. Meet up tomorrow. Hoping two people show up. I think two people are gonna show up. It's gonna be dope. Uh, great day today. Had fun. Uh, catch you guys tomorrow.